So another test to use when you're looking at the biomechanics, when you're looking at the AA joint, was um, the reproduction of headaches or restricted motion with the flexion rotation test. And that implicates the AA joint. So essentially what you're going to do is bring the AA joint into flexion and rotate to the right and to the left. Looking for, I believe it's a 15 to 20 degree difference between one side compared to the other. I try to be sensitive to the patient and make sure I get to a good barrier but not jam them up into hyperflexion. I want to know, this is where Ray stops. And then I look to the left and the right. I'm looking for that greater restriction on one side compared to the other, or reproduction of headaches. I probably already would have had a reproduction of headache with palpation. But this test has been shown that yes, you probably want to address something in the AA joint. But as we know with the biomechanics, it could implicate the AA joint. But also, if we're bringing him into flexion, there could be an aspect of the AO joint that's involved. But this is something that's actually been validated to use, knowing that when we do our techniques, we would see an improvement in range of motion. So it's an alternative test as well.